What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. In today's video we are going to be discussing the all new next generation Toyota Fortuner. This mid-size SUV is a top selling vehicle in many markets and now for the next model year of this vehicle, Toyota is going to be giving it a full redesign. There's going to be a brand new design both on the interior of the vehicle as well as the exterior of the vehicle, a bunch of new technology and also a brand new hybrid engine option and I'm going to be covering all of that in today's video so stay tuned. Starting off with the platform and design information about this all new Fortuner, this new SUV is going to be using Toyota's TNGAF platform which a lot of other Toyota vehicles use such as the all new Tundra, the new Sequoia and also the Land Cruiser. And for the design of this vehicle we do expect somewhat of a similar designed to the previous generation according to the spy shots, but we definitely do expect all new body panels, new headlamps, and new tail lamps to be on this new Fortuner. And according to some of the rumors and renders that we have of this new Fortuner, we may be getting similar design cues to that on the new Tundra and the new Sequoia, and also some design touches from the new Land Cruiser. And now discussing the powertrain of this all new Toyota Fortuner which is probably the biggest change that's coming to this vehicle more than the design or anything. So currently the Fortuner is powered by a 2.8 liter diesel engine and this is actually staying for the next generation version of the Fortuner but the biggest difference is coming in the hybrid system of this vehicle. Toyota is going to be making this 2.8 liter diesel engine paired with a mild hybrid system for the next generation version, making a diesel hybrid engine, which is going to be powering the next generation Fortuner. The result of having a hybrid system on board is obviously going to result in better fuel economy, but we do also expect some upgrades in power. The current Fortuner makes about 201 horsepower, and we do expect this new Fortuner to get slight increases to about 210 to 215 horsepower, and we do also expect the torque numbers to be pushed up to about 400 pound-feet of torque as well. And that concludes all of the information that I do have on this all new next generation Toyota Fortuner. Let me know if you guys are liking this vehicle, or if you're not liking this vehicle, thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, have a great day.